welcome hockey fans to the Confessions of a Hockey Fanatic blog. Now, I've got a confession to make. I guess you can say this has been like my third year attempt at trying to learn how to use uh, OBS and editors and everything like that. I've tried a couple years ago to do this, and I think I finally may have found my way to do this. Uh, uh, it is the Canada Day Cup celebration here for the longest running tradition of Confessions of a Hockey Fanatic. Now, when I started this 20 some years ago, uh, tw uh, 21 years ago to be sp uh, specific, uh, the one tradition that I've always kept is the Canada Day Cup every year on July 1st. Now, I have made so many friends through Canada and through this blog and I'm so happy to get to know uh, some of you fine citizens here as hockey fans and uh, as just you know through social media in general. And I wanted to you know, celebrate with you. I, I, I love the you know, patriotic holidays. you know I, I like the the well, hopefully you guys don't see this as you know, cultural appropriation. So I'm, I'm doing it again, ladies and gentlemen. I'm, uh, uh, even though I am personally not Canadian, I want to the, celebrate with you here uh, as uh, I've known uh, so many uh, good and awesome people through Ontario, uh, British Columbia, uh, sometimes in the Maritimes, and... Uh, I guess off into the, uh, Manitoba, and I don't think I know anybody in Saskatchewan. Uh, Alberta, yes, I, I do know uh, somebody in uh, Alberta as well. But uh, yes, I've made many friends up there. So uh, this is my Canada Day Cup celebration. Now, here are the rules. Uh, ever since this even dates back to my original first PlayStation, that uh, I've I got the uh, hockey game, uh, and I've updated uh, a hockey tournament where I've pitted all of the uh, Canadian teams starting out in their Canadian uh, province, I guess, opening rounds. Uh, they play their uh, provincial rivals. Uh, Toronto plays uh, Ottawa, uh, Montreal, and Quebec. Uh, the, uh, you know, Edmonton and uh, Calgary and uh, uh, Vancouver and Winnipeg, I guess they're, they're not provincial rivals but you know they were the uh, two remaining so they get paired up and there was also an additional rule that uh, I used uh, the uh, Colorado Avalanche as the historic uh, I guess now you can say like the uh, the the uh, the uh, legacy of the Quebec Nordiques but I still uh, put them in their Quebec Nordique uh, jerseys there and when I'm simulating this tournament online so uh, I wanted to uh, put together this package for you here as uh, highlights uh, to I guess capture uh, some of the things that I've been uh, doing I've been doing a lot of uh, live broadcasting over on another website uh, and I uh, I think I finally figured out how to you know, get you know, OBS working for me and uh, recording this. So uh, I want to do this as the official uh, premiere of a uh, hockey uh, uh, confessions of a hockey fanatic Canada Day 2023. Now this isn't uh, a simulated or uh, <laughs> sponsored stream here, but uh, yep, I for Canada Day I got my Timmies. So. I, I'm enjoying this as well uh, today. So I, I sit back, I relax, I have a little fun uh, with me as I, I show you some of the highlights of the tournament.
with them. Uh, the Nazi uh, Padre scored the goal. So that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, uh, that is my uh, highlight package there for uh, Canada Day Cup uh, 2023. Thank you, everyone, uh, for watching. Please leave in the comments down below how you celebrate this holiday. Uh, let me know uh, what you want to see for next year and uh, for years to come. Uh, God bless you, Canada. Happy Canada Day. <laughs>